on the law of equilibrium. So step one is to find the center of gravity. So you balance your meter stick on a pivot, as I've done with this uh, plastic meter stick. So a pivot, just a point that you balance on, and you find the center of gravity. Now in this case, it's interesting, the center of gravity is 50.5 centimeters, or 50.6 centimeters, not 50. You'd expect it to be 50, but of course, why isn't it in this case? Well, if we let's look at the meter stick, the one end of the meter stick doesn't stop at 100, keeps going. So there's extra meter stick beyond, extra plastic beyond the 100 centimeter mark. And there's also a hole in it. That question has been asked, why is it not at the 50? It's not at 50 because there can be extra plastic beyond 100 or there could be a hole in it. There'd be two answers. So when you're that done, your next step then is to get the weight of the meter stick. And what you would do, and I don't have it set up here, is you would just hang the meter stick at a center of gravity from a Newton balance and the reading in the Newton balance would tell you the, the weight of the meter stick. Okay. Step three then, you get you set up a situation like this. Okay, so if you look at it, okay, I have a Newton balance and I have two weights down, okay, and I have two Newton balances up. Okay. Now this is not very well set up, okay. There's a lot of work for me to do yet here, okay, because if you look at it, okay, the Newton balances are not vertical. They have to be vertical. Okay, and the um the meter stick would have to be horizontal. So you would you would spend some time moving the weights and moving the Newton balances so that the Newton balances are vertical, the weights will be vertical, okay, and that the uh, that the uh, meter stick is itself horizontal. When all that is done, you take the you note the weights of the meters of the you note the weights of, of the weights that are hanging down, you note the reading on the two Newton balances that are now vertical, okay, if they're not vertical, you have to go into start resolving vectors. It gets very messy, you have to start measuring angles. So you want everything vertical and horizontal. Those questions are also asked. Okay, so you would have, you, you will take the readings of the position and the weights or the forces up or down at each position and you're not going to forget the weight of the meter stick, which will be from its center of gravity in the middle. But we'll look at all that in the next clip uh, on the board.